If you have these signs of low estrogen as a woman, then you should get your hormones checked. Hot flashes or night sweats. If you're waking up in a puddle of sweat, that is not normal. Dryness, we're talking dry eyes, dry skin, vaginal dryness. Estrogen keeps our tissues moist, lubricated, and hydrated, so low estrogen causes dryness. Changes in your libido, we usually think of testosterone for this, but estrogen's involved too. Painful sex can be another one. Like I mentioned, estrogen's important for our vaginal health and keeping the tissues healthy. Joint pain, that's kind of come out of nowhere. I sound like a broken record at this point, but estrogen keeps our tissues hydrated and moist. Think of it as like lubricant for our joints. When estrogen levels go down, arthritis can creep up. You're starting to notice heart palpitations, like your heart is skipping a beat. It could be other things, but low estrogen's one of them. Mood swings, especially if you start to feel low, down, less sparkly. Brain fog is a huge one. Forgetting where you placed your keys, what you're about to do, or all around just feeling like you're in a daze. Starting to notice that your hair's not growing as much or it feels more brittle or your nails start to feel more brittle too. Keep in mind, these symptoms can be other things too, not just signs of low estrogen. So that's why testing is essential. If you still have regular periods, you would test your estrogen and progesterone on day 21 of your cycle. That is 21 days after the start of your period. If your periods are all over the place, you're in perimenopause, you can just kind of test whenever. 